I've always been crazy for the trouble that it's put me through. You know, I've been working my whole life to try to be the man I am today, up and down a lot of different roads. Kind of a wild kid, got in a lot of trouble when I was young, and uh, got in really a whole bunch of trouble while I was in Dallas. My little brother wound up in prison, and uh, my mama said I needed to go out and live with my daddy. So I moved out to West Texas, and uh, that's where I like to think I became a man, you know. Before that, I was pretty irresponsible, just getting in trouble with the law and all kinds of crazy stuff. But, that's where I met my Uncle Bo, and the first thing he said to me is, you got any boots, boy? <laughs> and he gave me, he gave me got, took me out and bought me a pair of work boots, and I went to work in the oil field the next day. Worked on a cotton farm for about 10 years, and then my mama got sick. And when my mama got sick, I moved back home to Dallas, took care of her for a little while. And her last request was for me to, to uh, you know, try to do something with music. I went to rehab, and Learned more in 28 days than I did in 27 years of drug addiction. Ever since then, I've been sober. I've been sober about three years now. I've been putting on the best shows of my life, been writing some great music. And I give all the glory to God on that, you know. I pray every morning with my family, and I pray every night before I go to bed. And I'm a firm believer, if you do right by God, he'll do right by you. Most of my fans are all friends of mine, you know. We get to know each other at, after every show. I go to the merch booth and we shake hands and talk. And I'm pretty well an open book. I'm just a normal guy. who likes to play music and enjoys entertaining the crowds, you know. But when the party's all over, I go back home and I call my wife and kids and we talk and we pray. And I go to bed and I get up, and get on the road and drive and go to the next show until it's time to go back home to my family. And that's what I look forward to every night, getting back home to my family.